Welcome ladies and gentlemen, Gohamian here with Misfit Studios as always, and today I'm going to show you how to create a super simple counter using HitFilm Express. Alright, to go ahead and start this little simple countdown, what we're going to do is we're going to click New Composite Shot. Um, we're going to change the duration to 11 seconds because we're going to use a 10 second countdown. Give us plenty of time um, within our timeline here to... Uh, do the compositing. Um, first, we're going to go ahead and add in our text. Let's go ahead and do that. We're going to start with 9, enter, 8, all the way to 0. We're going to go over to our text panel, move our scale way up. That way it's nice and large. 1024, it's the largest it can go. We're going to drag that down a little bit. That way it's centered. To make sure that it's perfectly centered though, we can actually go ahead and add a new plane in. Make sure our text is at the top so we can see it. Scroll down in our effects window to presets. Go to 2D effects and then add the 1080 title safe guide to our new plane layer. And as you can see, it gives us a nice little um, grid that we can center everything with. So let's go ahead and center our, um, center our text here, this nine right in the middle of the screen. Okay, we're going to go ahead and keep this grid up for right now because it's going to allow us to align um, everything else as we go along too. So let's go ahead and um, go to our text and we're going to go to the controls, hit the transform button. We're going to go ahead and keyframe our position. So let's go ahead and keyframe the very first frame. Make sure your slider is all the way over to the left. We're then going to change the slider to 10 seconds. And then we're going to move our position of our numbers all the way till we reach zero. Make sure it's nice and centered, just like that. If we bring this back to the beginning and go ahead and play that, it's going to run through those numbers. So now what we want to do is we actually want those numbers to um, change every second. So let's go ahead and add in an effect called stutter under the grunge folder in your effects tab and then apply that to the text layer. I'm going to go over to the controls, bring down the stutter and we're going to put in 30 frames. So every 30 frames, because if you remember we had 30 frames per second on our composite shot, so every 30 frames is going to be a second. Now if we go ahead and click play, it's going to change those numbers every 30 seconds. Now the spacing in between our numbers is obviously not perfect and so what we need to do is we need to go through then and change the position of each number it's really pretty simple to do all you have to do is go and advance the slider by one second it shows the eight go ahead and highlight the text go to the controls transform and then change um, the height that way it's centered in the middle on the position do that for every single number go to two seconds and then move that one up just a little bit as well and then zero so now if we go ahead and go back to the beginning, go ahead and hit play, as you can see, every 30 frames or every second, the position of those numbers changes, giving you this nice, smooth little countdown or counter, as you will, that you can put in front of anything. If you want to um, take the background out and render this or export this without the background, I've got a video. Um, I'll put the link in the description below on how to remove a background out of an, out of an image. Um, you can either do that you know, using Inkscape, and then I've got another tutorial on how to do that in HitFilm Express if it's a video just like this. Um, thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching. Gorhamian here with Misfit Studios, as always, and we will see you guys next time. Thank you.